but I wanted to watch the official trailer for Bye Bye Barry as the greatest mystery in sports history as Barry Sanders retired early from the Detroit Lions. Let's check this out. We'll never see somebody like Barry Sanders again. It was lightning from the first snap that he took. Because of that, Detroiters were just all in. For this second, he's here, and then a thousand one, he's not here anymore. He's over there, and you're tackling air. Normal joints don't move the way Barry Sanders' joints move. I'm sorry. How do you juke people, get to the end zone, and just give the ball to the ref? He's so humble, and it's real. He just wanted to play football. This guy did something special every single Sunday. He gave Detroit a sense of hope that the city desperately needed. It's a privilege to be one of the players that will help restore the roar. Ryan Sanders, Detroit is back! We had the greatest running back that ever played the game. But then, Touchdown! something happened. Shocking announcement has thousands of fans feeling flustered. Barry Sanders will retire, not with the press conference, but with a statement. He sends a fax Fax machine? Everybody's trying to figure out why. What the F are you doing? Was Barry frustrated playing for a losing team? Is this a bargaining ploy? My dad was opinionated. It was tough to experience that. He would tell Barry, he'll never be better than Jim Brown. He was affected by guys who got hurt. Or his teammates suffer serious injuries. Nobody walks away at the peak of their powers like this. There has to be something else. Marker. And I love it because the Lions are doing good, finally. Um, they had their run with Megatron and Matthew Stafford, but even with uh, Megatron, Calvin Johnson, he also did the same thing as Barry Sanders did. I think um, he confided in Barry Sanders, and I think he got the real reason of why Barry Sanders retired, and he did so as well. And they're both going to be in the Hall of Fame. Uh, Barry's in the Hall of Fame already, but I know um, Calvin Johnson is going to be in the Hall of Fame. And... I want to watch this because I wanted to hear from Barry Sanders himself because I'm pretty sure he talked about it, but now you have an in-depth documentary where he can finally, like, I will tell you why, you know, and it was just, he probably saw the horizon, you playing, and it was a culmination of a, many things of, you know, you playing for a losing team, you never really, you only reached the playoffs like once or twice in his whole career, not going all the way, not giving him help, you know, offensive line, quarterback, receivers, defense, you're not helping him really. Um, the injuries, the, the life-threatening injuries that you're seeing on the field, people that you really play with, and it's kind of like, that can be me in, in, a, in a snap of a second. Somebody can break my leg and all this is gone, so they'll hate me. Um, so it's a culmination. Then it, with his father, I think his he was he had the only dad out there, and I remember that also affected him too. Like he was like, "Where everybody else's dad?" And like he got his dad, and his dad is like, you know, very no nonsense, hard on him, you know, and that's what made him really good. And you know, and so you you probably had a, a culmination of things that affected why he retired. And then he sent it in with a fax, no no press coverage, no nothing. He just was like, "I'm out the door, bye." Um, so. I'm here for it. So, you guys enjoyed my reaction to Bye Bye Barry, official trailer coming to Prime Video November 21st. Subscribe to my channel, post a comment down below, and like the video. It's your boy, D. Dyson. Peace.